let's <clears throat> all talk about Australian soccer. Yeah. Bum the moment. Um. First of all, what I like to say is, on Portuguese, we call it football. In Europe, they call it football. In Africa, they call it football. In South America, they call it football. In Russia, they call it football. Football or whatever it is. Um, <clears throat> but in certain Asian countries, like Australia, New Zealand, and America, they call it soccer. What's up with the name soccer? It's you kick it with your foot and it's a ball. You know, it's 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 not that hard. You you just call it football. You know how hard is it to name a ball a soccer? How can you name it soccer? I, I don't know how they come up with that name for, but it it's not soccer. It's football. You kick it with your foot. In Aussie rules, they call it football because you kick it with your foot. <clears throat> In baseball, they call it baseball because there are bases. You run to it and you hit the ball. Fair enough. Cricket? Fair enough. Uh, gridiron is different as well. Because you catch with your hand and touch down and kick it, everything. But, it's not called soccer. It's football. Don't the Americans and Australians get it? Football. Another thing I want to bring up is why we don't have the World Cup here in Australia. That's because there's only a certain number of people who watch the game. You know, why bring the game over here when we can't, we don't, we have a lot of people that are interested in it, but there probably won't be enough people going to the match. And the stadiums are too small. Um, I mean, I would love to see the World Cup hold, held over here, but first of all, change the name soccer to football. It's football, not soccer. It's a round ball. You kick it with your foot. It goes in the goal. It's called football. And that's it. Thank you. Bye-bye.